nice when you find places like this that they have this dif different format and you can really make you think about how to use that. And I think when we received the image of this building, straight away we have this idea. Because we saw the building and say, okay, this is a subway car. And really connect with uh, what we like, what we love, the trains. And our background, like graffiti. Uh, and we just wanted to integrate this, ch change the space, the whole entire building and transforming uh, like a big installation. Like a big, like, let's say like a sculpture. Because our work, they, some years, we really start to like uh, find places like this, that they have like the sh sh shape, you say shape, the format, different, and to integrate, to transform in what we see. I think it's very direct communication we find to communicate with the people like you just feel to go out and write something and paint something and you just do it you know do for the people that live under the bridge you know do for everybody it's different you to be like inside of a museum or gallery it's different point, point of view our work for us is always the same, is what we believe. Even worry if it's what the people call, you know, but we worry what we believe in this world that we create, this fantasy world that we draw in, we believe. And sometimes we need this space like inside to represent this, to make you come inside of our world. And sometimes you need the outside. We born with this inside of us, and then we just try to every day to to see more and learn more from this world that we believe, and learn more how to share with the people in different media like sculptures, paintings, installations. And for us, it's always uh, it's like we have a book, and we try to illustrate this book. And sometimes we do things like that, big things like that, or sometimes we do small things. But everything, it's part of one big history that we believe we write. We grew up in Sao Paulo. I'm born in there, in the neighborhood called Cambuci. That's a very strong hip hop culture back in the days, in the 80s. It's funny to see like how people need to have a title or to put a hotel, how you say, stamp. stamp yeah and everything. Uh, we see what we do as art. Very simple as that. And people can call how they want, but for us what we do is we just find different medias and techniques to express what we believe. Our background is graffiti. But for us we have, we really divide very well and very clean in our mind what we do. Like for us graffiti is outside, it's like you go in the city, you change the city. When you do something inside of a museum or a gallery, it's not graffiti, it's not, nothing related to street art. The ephemeral that we try to put it here is like life. It's like moments in life. It's like thinkings. Your thinkings can be ephemeral. The way you see the life can be very ephemeral. Your, uh, the way you, you share your uh, emotions or love can be ephemeral. <laughs>